What's going on guys? I just wanted to make a video to update you on my Mossberg 590 shockwave. Um, I had some stuff done to it and uh, I had some other stuff done to my Glock 19. I'm kind of torn between, another thing I wanted to mention is I'm kind of torn between making firearm videos and tool videos. Firearms are my main passion. Tools would be something that I just, I don't know, they're fascinating to me. I like having the right tool for the right job. So I'm going to continue to make those tool videos as well. I'll probably drop one um, Friday or something. Maybe make it tonight and drop it Friday. But anyways, last time I showed you guys the shockwave, it looked pretty much just like this. But... I told you guys I was going to get an adjustable brace, so got rid of this bad boy. Bam! It's got four positions. This is how she looks extended all the way out. A lot more manageable. Well, comfortable. So, we had one, two, three, Four. so I got four right there um, I'm probably gonna change this out this plastic side rail came well shell holder came with the shotgun I bought it completely stock other than this on here and it also had this on here I think I'm pretty positive it had this and this and that was it so I bought the SB tactical brace set up like this but since i already had everything up here all i needed was the buffer tube and um this brace piece right here so it wasn't very expensive i didn't have to rebuy any of this stuff right here i have the crimson trace um what is this it's like the 13 the 1300 s i think have to look back into that i got the box in the closet got the enforce light at the end i have a carlson barrel on there it has a uh, little fiber optic guy on there it's ported um they're like that they're 226 bucks i think i bought mine three years ago or so but what i did do is i put the original barrel on eBay and I sold it for around $200 or so I don't remember but so what I did for the Glock this is my Glock 17 here's the factory Glock sights on it they're made of plastic I ended up buying some Ameriglo troopers well the trooper yeah, Mariglow sites, but the Trooper um, edition. They're not really cheap, but they're really, really nice. So you got the Glock 17 with the standard sights on it right there. Gen 4. Then I have my Gen 5 Glock 19 with the Ameriglows on it. They're actually glowing right now because of the shadow. I know a lot of guys and girls out here, they um they end up going with the red. But I really, really like the way that that orange is, not orange, I meant to say that, the uh, the yellow green looked. I really like it a lot. The one guy at the gun store, he liked the blacked out rear with the red. The other guy likes the um, the one dot in the middle, the one tritium dot in the middle, and then the red in the front. But I'm happy with this. This guy right here, I'm going to have to upgrade. I might do the same color. I might do red to be different. But it just looks so much better. I've got a bunch more guns. If you guys are interested, 
and maybe me doing like a a collection video or something i could definitely show you guys some of the other firearms i have got decent amount of handguns in here got some other rifles and i just got stuff everywhere but these ameriglos pretty nice pretty pricey they're 120 but that was um they if you buy the sites from them they'll install them for you the cheapest i found these sites was like 90 dollars on amazon and uh i don't mind doing stuff myself i actually I, I have fun working on guns by myself but um you know you got to support your local gun stores as much as you can because they really do take care of you it's kind of like uh local gun stores are kind of like tool truck guys you know um, at least the gun store i go to they're they really take care of you if you ever have an issue you bring in whatever you bought from them and and they're happy to help you if you have an issue with a firearm that you bought at bass pro shops or something like that um you know good luck having them help you out so support your local guys pay 20 bucks extra have them install it for free because usually if you buy stuff from them they'll just do it for you so i'm happy with my purchases the site and the parts all right guys thanks for watching get yourself one of these you won't regret it